Hey, so what up guys, Matthew with Drag Tech, back again with another video for you guys. And in this video, we're going to be looking at the Yubao power bank. And you might be thinking this is a regular power bank, you know, you can get many other power banks similar to this. But why the reason I got this is because this is power delivery, FCP, which is a Huawei's fast charging protocol, and also Samsung's quick charge compatible. So it means that basically you can use this power bank with any device and get the maximum charging speed. By the way, this uh, power delivery power bank is uh, capable of up to 18 watts and this is also a 10,000 milliamp hour power bank. And you know, iPad Pros are not really easy to charge with a regular power bank because of the enormous battery capacity. So I've actually charged it with a couple of Xiaomi power banks which have quick charge 3.0 and they weren't really able to top up the iPad at a very fast speed. So this power bank, which only costs a mere 19 to 20 ringgit which is about five to six us dollars it gets the job done pretty well and i read tons of comments and also reviews on this and that people are saying this works like a charm so i had to get my hands on it of course i bought it at the flash sale for 19 ringgit so i mean 19 ringgit for a power bank hmm you might be having doubts about it and i was also having doubts initially that this was the original yubao power bank because you know yubao power banks are known for a lot of clones but uh i've checked it you can see it right here I'm not sure the camera is going to focus but right here this is definitely authentic product so before we get this unboxing started if you're new to this channel hit the subscribe button enable notifications so you can get notified on content which i post on a weekly basis of course i've been missing in action for two weeks because i have big news and i'll be probably showing it to you guys the next video uh but anyways here we are with the yubao power delivery power bank and let's get right into the unboxing <music> Alright guys, so we are back and we'll be doing a very very quick unboxing because I mean what is it to a power bank? A power bank is basically very simple. So I actually took out my iPad cable, the original charging cable, USB-C to USB-C cable to show you that it does indeed charge the iPad Pro. Alright, so on the top you can see Yubao branding. On the right side you can see 3 output PD, 18 watt quick charge power bank. You see charging a, a MacBook. So imagine carrying this with a MacBook. I mean, you have like all day battery life with your MacBook. Isn't that the best thing ever? I mean, I don't have a MacBook, but I use an iPad. So I think it's uh, pretty much the same. And if this is able to charge a MacBook, this should be able to charge any USB-C type laptop. If you have like a MateBook or maybe Honor Book, something like that, this will be able to charge you as well. So it's a good thing to have in your backpack because in case you do run out of power, this is able to charge up your laptops quickly so you can see the specs at the bottom right here pretty much uh, self-explanatory okay you can see official Yubao product right here so this was actually what I was worried about but anyways okay let's cut open the seal right so finally opening the box let's take out the contents come on I'm gonna slide out Right, so the first thing to drop out is actually the USB cable, which is a USB-C to USB-A. Not bad, this can also charge the power bank as well. Putting that to the side, let's see what else comes in the box. Alright, let's take a look at the contents. So we put the power bank to the side first. So this is a quick start manual. Well, basically self-explanatory. Uh, let's see, that's it. Right, very simple. Okay, let's take a look at the power bank and the size as well. Wow, it's actually really small. Okay, let me bring my 11 Pro Max as size comparison. You can see the size. Really, really small. Of course, it's the thickness of two 11 Pro Max. But I mean, it's okay. Considering that it's very lightweight, it's about the weight of an uh, iPhone as well. Slightly lighter, I guess. Or around the same weight. So it's not too bad, actually. Well, so let's see the display. So we have a display in front. Get the camera to focus. So we have a display in front. You can see 32% charge. So this is uh, more accurate than actually using the lights because you know the four LED uh, status, which usually comprises of 25% each. I mean, having a screen is so much better. Of course, it looks a lot orange on the camera, but in real life, it's actually red. Okay, let's take a look at the outputs and inputs. So you can see USB-C. This is an input as well as an output, so it's uh, pretty good. I mean, I can just bring one cable and I can charge it as well as, you know, charge my devices with this 
then there's also two fast charging ports if you do want to charge your samsung device or so on and so forth very nice and lightweight power bank you can see the yuba branding on the front very nice and clean design i like the all black design you can see on the back 10,000 amps hour i really do like this power bank okay so let's give it a try let's try to charge my ipad with this power bank so i have my usb-c to usb-c cable right here let me grab my ipad okay so i have an ipad here let me show you right so let me plug it in right here you can see it's charging it's charging the ipad so i mean that's a great thing because i do have one more power bank uh which is a pinang brand and honestly that power bank i thought was able to charge via USB-C with power delivery but in fact it didn't it couldn't work so i'm actually putting that to the side because that's actually a um, maximum of 2.1 amps on both ports but this is however a much better deal and it's even cheaper than that power bank because it's only 19 ringgit that was around 25 if i'm not mistaken all right so this power bank definitely a go definitely a go so i would recommend this power bank to people using macbooks ipads or even your iphone as well if you do want to charge your iphone quickly on the go this is definitely a solution because you know the iphone 11 pro max comes with the usb-c to lightning cable so you can actually plug in the usb-c on one end to the power bank and the lightning into your device but of course i do not use that because i'm actually using a wireless charger so i prefer wireless charging because of uh, basically the ease of use so I can just put my phone on there and it's charging. I don't like to plug in my devices unless I'm in the car or something. But anyways, highly recommend this power bank. Uh, you can see the percentage dropping uh, pretty quickly because I actually haven't charged it up. I'm supposed to charge the power bank full on the first charge. So this has been a very quick unboxing of the Ubal Quick Charge Power Bank with power delivery support. So I'll leave the links in the description below if you do want to pick this up. Definitely recommend it. You can see the battery even dropping further as I'm finishing up this video that's all for this video thanks guys for watching the next video i'll be unboxing some pretty affordable airpods pro clones i should say or maybe not clones but i mean they're really really hot selling in malaysia at least and i'll be definitely showcasing them in the next video so thanks guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video